this is a reunion for me. 35 years ago, I moved the Enterprise for the first. I sent a lot of letters to President Gerald Ford at the time, and the President logically decided that the ship should be named after our spaceship Enterprise, and that's how this Enterprise came to be named. What a great day that was in 1976. We, the cast of Star Trek, were invited to be there in Palmdale, California, when this ship was rolled out. For the first time, the hangar doors opened. This wonderful ship came rolling out, and the Air Force Band played the theme from Star Trek. It was a great day for America, a great day for us to be connected to that history. We're very grateful. The space shuttle was built with 1970s technology. It's a very interesting aspect of this today as Enterprise lands. You think about in that history what we have developed technically. And if we're going to have that Star Trek future, we need to use today's technology to go back into space at a cost that is less and to be able to take us farther. It's actually a very exciting time. the scientists, the engineers who make these wonderful things happen, I say 